Here we go. Three wide. Jimmy. Oh! And Jimmy Foster's on his side down the back stretch. Four cars coming through. Scott Frailing is involved. One car spinning around upside down down the back straight away. And it comes to rest on all fours as the field tries to get slowed down. Wow. And all of a sudden he's going to touch the apron. No, Frailing. Now I think it's exactly what you were talking about before the air. These little cars just moved them back and forth, and they just moved into each other. Yeah, it just moved the center cars from left to right. It got away from him. He got in the outside car, came back across his head, Foster, pinned him on the outside wall with those three guys. It looked like Bill Elliott and myself and Dale Earnhardt at Talladega last year when Elliott was, or Earnhardt was up on the hood of our cars. Same kind of deal, and everybody else had no place to go. A different look looking up from turn three. You see Foster's car get up on its side, go into the outside catch fence. There's Frailing there. The 28th car of Kelly is there. They come back across. And there we see Frailing hit the... Se is that the 75 car? It looks like Brent Moore, the Grease Lightning car. The Gary Moore on car. And it's up on its roof, spinning around and around, coming toward us. The Grease Lightning Ford. These two cars got together. These three cars got together right here. They're in front of two-thirds of the field. They're all running in that pack. You saw him go back up and hit the yellow car come down and get in the Foster, boom, Hop Good's got no place to go. They're in that wreck. There's four cars in that bunch right up against the wall right there. Here's the tire comes off. These guys are trying to avoid it. No place to go. And there we see Craylin is going to touch, as we think it's a 75 car, and he just starts tumbling down the back stretch. 